This 5'10 point guard from Lubbock, Texas is going to be the next big thing for women's college basketball. The popularity in women's basketball has absolutely exploded this past year, especially at the collegiate level. The women's NCAA tournament championship game reached a peak of 12.6 million total viewers. The crazy amount of people tuned in helped players like Angel Reese and Caitlin Clark transform into not only household basketball names, but also celebrities. And there is one player entering her junior year of high school that I believe has the potential to be the biggest name in all of college basketball, Aliyah Chavez. Aliyah first came onto my radar in 2022 after her freshman season. She averaged 26 points, eight rebounds, and seven assists as a 15-year-old playing varsity at Monterey High School. What you're watching now is highlights from Aliyah's highest scoring performance of her freshman season, a 50-point game. It's so easy for her that she looks like a senior playing JV. Aliyah dominated whatever competition was thrown her way, but I still didn't expect her to have this successful of a summer because against some of the best 17U AAU competition on the EYBL circuit, Aliyah Chavez finished 12th in scoring. Remember, she did all of this at 15 years old. Not to mention, she helped lead her Cypher Elite team to a national championship. All this success built up anticipation of what Aliyah would accomplish in her sophomore year. Well, it's safe to say she delivered on any expectation that was put on her. As a sophomore, Aliyah averaged 30 points, 7 rebounds, 5 assists, and 3 steals in the 34 games she played on the season. A few months back, I made it out to Aaliyah's game against Duncanville, and out of all the players in this talented matchup, Aaliyah no doubt stood out the most. Her shot making display was phenomenal in this game. At the end of Aaliyah's sophomore year, she totaled 1,020 points on the season, breaking the single season record she set as a freshman, which was 1,001 points. Aaliyah also went on to have another strong individual summer in basketball. She played on the EYBL circuit again for Cypher Elite, and in the national tournament, led everyone in scoring with 23 points points per game. Aliyah Chavez is now ranked as the number one player in the 2025 class and has offers from just about any major college program you could think of. But just because someone is good in high school doesn't mean they will thrive at the next level. The game is played differently. The competition is much better. There are just so many factors that make the transition to college difficult for certain hoopers. So do I really believe that Aliyah Chavez will not only be great in college, but also one of the biggest names and best players? Yes, and here is why. The first and most important reason is that Aliyah Chavez has the skill level to be one of the best hoopers in all of women's college basketball right when she gets to that level. What Aliyah has accomplished these past two years proves that she is one of the best scorers and passers girls high school basketball has ever seen. She helped lead her 17U EYBL team to a national championship as a freshman. She averaged 30 points per game as a sophomore. Who even knows what she will amount to in her last two years of high school? The second reason is that Aliyah has a perfect build for a girls college point guard. She stands at 5'10", which is taller than the average point guard at the D1 level. And she has gotten a lot stronger this past year by constantly being in the lab. Her current build and level of physical strength is next level, and she still has two more years in high school left to play. The third reason is the amount of confidence that Aaliyah possesses. She thrives in big moments and is always wanting to play against the best. Listen to this sit-down conversation she had with Paige Beckers. Is there anybody in college or the WNBA that you want to play? You? Yeah. I think I'll give you buckets, bro. That's tough. I respect the confidence. Confidence. If you give me 30, I'm gonna give you 30. I don't know. I, I take defense pretty seriously. I understand, but like for me, you're gonna have to guard like 30 screens, ball screens, off screens, down screens. I don't stop moving, that's the thing. So when it comes to me, you're gonna have to play team defense. So it's not necessarily all your fault if I score yeah, 30. Yeah, it's happening still. Uh, right. I don't think you got 30 on me. We'll see, we'll see. Now I'm not saying I agree with what Aaliyah is saying, but seeing that level of confidence directed towards Paige Beckers is not common for a high school hooper. The fourth and final reason is the flair she always plays with on the hardwood. I would argue social media is the biggest factor in transforming elite college hoopers into superstar status. And what is the best way of getting posted by sports media outlets? Having crazy highlights. The combination of Aaliyah's flashiness and pure skill level on the basketball court is a recipe for viral videos. All of this exposure that I'm anticipating her to get from social media will help build a massive fan base around her. Again, these are all the traits that every superstar girls hooper has. The skill level to be one of the best. A crazy amount of confidence. An exciting play style that is easy to fall in love with as a fan. And being able to thrive in the biggest moments. Aliyah Chavez is a player who checks every single one of those boxes, leading me to believe that she'll be the next superstar for girls college basketball. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out the one I did on five young basketball
basketball prodigies who will take over the men's side of the sport. Over the last couple of years, I have watched a lot of talented young hoopers, and I am confident that the players I mention in this video will pan out to be great. If you enjoyed the video that you just watched, you will definitely love this one. And if you're at this point, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification button for more content like this.